Hello and welcome to MyCADSite.com and this tutorial is about line thickness and although not a true 3D method it does give a 3D likeness to your drawing and this is used with standard 2D commands and gives a 3D look. So I'm just going to erase these and show you how I can draw this chair using just four rectangles and line thickness is a good way to get a 3D look if you're using AutoCAD LT or some other programs that don't have full 3D capabilities but it's quick and it's easy and almost anyone can do it so I'm just putting in the four rectangles here I'm drawing the arms and the base and now I'm just drawing the seat of the chair and now I just should put them on the correct layers and in 3D it's good to have everything on the right layer or else uh, you can get lost very quickly with a bunch of lines that are the same color it also allows you to turn the layers on and off so now that I've got my arm selected I'm gonna go up to the properties icon and there's a few ways of getting into your properties dialog box and look for line thickness it's just called thickness and I put in a value of 24 to give the arms the height of 24 units and escape to deselect them and then do a similar thing with the seat this goes a 4 inch thickness and finally the back of the chair will get a 34 inch line thickness and this is a little different than line weight so it's good to remember that as well so there's the basic chair now I just have to move the seat up 12 units so pick my displacement point and then from there it's relative 0, 0, 0012 meaning 12 units in the positive Z axis and that is it my uh, chair is done as you can see it's just four rectangles if you look at it from the top but when you switch to an isometric view such as southeast isometric in this point you can see that as I use the 3D orbit it does give a real 3D look even though it is only 2D objects with added line thickness and from there I can still use the hide command which gives it a further look towards 3D and in following tutorials you'll see how we'll draw this chair using a couple more methods and ones that are a bit more powerful to use in real 3D. So line thickness just to review it's very good for just 2D very quick um, if you have a floor plan you can draw the walls and give them an 8 foot line thickness and that'll give you a 3D building very quickly. So thanks for watching this has been mycadsite.com